Welcome back. Happening around our community this morning, some new material, both artistic and historic, is making its way to a museum near you. The Neville Public Museum will be the host of three fresh exhibits celebrating the arts and local history. Local 5's Calvin Lewis is live from the museum to show us how they're keeping things fresh. Well, Shelly, Caitlin, good morning to you both. That is exactly right. The Neville, they are always highlighting local history but also some local artwork here they've made it their mission to do that here at the museum we're actually inside one of the brand new exhibits reviving traditional arts of the oneida and i gotta say it's it's pretty eye-opening and we're joined alongside kevin here he's one of the curators at the museum and kevin thanks so much for joining us out this morning my pleasure good morning calvin good morning. yeah so we're we're in reviving traditional arts of the oneida or the oniotaka so the oneida have been in wisconsin almost 200 years this exhibit is really highlighting that collaboration between the Oneida Nation Arts Program and the Oneida Nation Museum, together with the Neville. So we have collection pieces from both of our collections as well as contemporary artists. And we wanted to highlight, as you can see right here behind me, we got touch screens and you can learn about these artists, see master craftspeople with apprentices, and then you see their art forms and what they produced over the last, really now, five decades in, uh, in the Wisconsin, Northeast Wisconsin area. And speaking about some of these items that we have uh, displayed in these showcases in front of us, uh, just where do these items come from? I understand that you guys have, uh, you know, a, a huge, uh, well, a wide variety of, of things that are also kept in storage. Yeah, we have pottery, some going back to over 500 years, very <laughs> unique archaeological artifacts found actually in Door County that show now that there's, there's a connection between New York way before the, the settlement of the Oneida in 1823 uh, in Wisconsin. So, Really what these art forms and the archaeological material show us is that the pottery and the potters themselves, the contemporary artists, can draw inspiration from these artifacts and then produce work like their ancestors did even thousands of years ago. And this is a collaborative effort that you guys have done with the Oneida Nation, correct? It is, and it's also bilingual. So we had a cultural advisor, uh, Bob Brown uh, of the Oneida Nation. So we have the, the translations of each title. But with the uh, Stacy Kuhn at the Oneida Nation Museum, and Cheryl Benton and Beth Bashera uh, at the Oneida Nation Arts Program. So really, it was over a year in the works and interviewing artists and getting their stories and really reviving these traditional art forms is what it was all about. Really some insightful information there, Kevin. Hey, thank you again so much for having us out this morning. My pleasure. Thanks, Calvin. So the new Oneida exhibit going to be on display here only at the Neville Public Museum starting now until about June 13th. So still plenty of time to come on down, bring on the family and uh, have maybe a little cultural and historical lesson or two along the way. Guys, we'll send it on back to you for now in the studio. All right, thanks, Calvin. You know what's really cool is a lot of times you just see pieces of pottery, but mm -hmm. these were whole pots and they were so beautiful. Very beautiful. It's yes. a really cool exhibit. Thanks, Calvin.